They're warming up. I so, have to wait to trot till they get warm. Oh, you already all warmed up? Holy moly. So anyways, she's up. Trainer's on the way. We're ready to go. It's a busy day. Honest horse, eh? We are trying out spurs for the first time and he's like what is happening who gave the kid the spurs i think she's afraid of this the spurs because she thinks it'll throw him into a fit.
The fact that his head isn't flying all around shows that she's having some control and not spurring him every step. You can touch, tell the second she uses the spur. And you can tell the second she doesn't post lightly. I read something recently where it was talking about how people need to start respecting the process again because people, especially with social media now, value the end product. They never respect the process and especially with like kids learning, but even adults, like look at me, respecting the process of learning is so important.
things I let go floating on the way We go bottoms up, we go all the way When you're feeling down, push the pain away We go bottoms up, we go all the way I do not think Sophie would have been ready for the Spurs and doing so well had she not done all those lessons prior. Yeah, I don't think she would have been ready. Sylvie's doing amazing with these spurs, I can't even believe it. Come on and give it a shot, but you'll be missing the cut. I think she knows that she drives them crazy when she's looking like that. The way she's moving makes them want it so bad. Gets the attention that we wish that we had. Yeah, it's almost cruel, cause I want her to. Oh, yeah. happened in her lesson I can't wait to show it to you guys but we're behind a lesson so it'll be in like a well you guys put it on the computer yeah uh, yeah we want to watch because at one point he got to the gate and wanted to leave and Sophie said no and then what did he do <laughs> he bucked he reared he did a pig route 
So it's where they go up and down, up and down. So he wasn't like rearing. Well, last, at the last one, he went up and then down. And then I was like, get going. Yeah. So I was like on his neck. So then Sophie told him, no, we're not doing that. And then <laughs> and he's I, like, I'm bored. This is boring. Anyways, so he did a pig root at the gate because he wanted to leave. But what happened in this lesson that was kind of exciting? I used spurts. You taught her how to use them. Use it and then stop. You guys will see in the lesson. Anyway, Storm, it was so good. Storm, when he moves forward, stop. So the two big things we learned in this lesson were oh, I'm so sorry. that Storm always tells you. So if she lands too hard in the saddle, he raises his head. And when she does it good, he puts his head right down. And he always tosses his head when she spurs so she can tell if she's spurring him too much because he'll be tossing his head if he's just going around normal then it means that she's not touching him every time with the spurs which has been which was beautiful to see i've never liked spurs before and for the first time i could see the the benefit of it this won't come undone it's, it's stuck mm -hmm. don't you know that you're beautiful